4.37. Good afternoon, and welcome to another edition of Science Today. On today's program, we are going to hear about women inventors. When we think of famous inventors, we usually think of men. People like Alexander Graham Bell, Guglielmo Marconi, Thomas Edison. But as Sally will tell us, many of the things that make our lives easier today were invented by women. That's absolutely right. Let's take the dishwasher, for example. This was invented by a woman named Josephine Cochran in 1886. She was a rich American who gave a lot of dinner parties, but she was annoyed that her servants used to break plates and glasses when they were washing the dishes after a party. So, Josephine decided to try and invent a machine that could wash a lot of plates and glasses safely. Apparently, she said, if nobody else is going to invent a dishwasher, then I will. She designed the machine, and then she found a company to make it. At first, only hotels and restaurants bought Josephine's new machine, but today, the dishwasher is used by millions of people all over the world. The car was invented by a man, but it was a woman, Mary Anderson, who in 1903 solved one of the biggest problems of driving. Until her invention, it was impossible for drivers to see where they were going when it was raining or snowing. They had to open their window. The name of Mary's invention? Windshield wipers. An invention that definitely improved the lives of millions of people was disposable diapers. They were invented by a woman named Marion Donovan. Her father and uncle were inventors, and when she had young children, she sat down and invented a diaper that you could use and then throw away. Anybody who has a small baby will know what a big difference disposable diapers make to our lives. But although she invented it in 1950, it wasn't until 1961 that an American company bought Marion's idea. Today, more than 55 million disposable diapers are used every day, and Marion's invention has been made more eco-friendly. Now you can buy biodegradable diapers. And now to our next inventor. In 1956, Betty Nesmith Graham was working as a secretary. Like all secretaries at that time, she used to get very frustrated and angry when she made typing mistakes. In those days, if you made a mistake, you had to get a new sheet of paper and start again from the beginning. Then she had a brilliant idea, which was to use a white liquid to paint over mistakes. Her invention is called whiteout today. Miss Graham was a divorced mother, and her invention made her a very rich woman. Her son, Mike Nesmith, became a famous pop star. He was a member of the American group, The Monkees. And finally, police officers, soldiers, and politicians all over the world are protected by something that was invented by a woman. In 1966, Stephanie Qualick invented Kevlar, a special material that was very light but incredibly strong, much stronger than metal. This material is used to make bulletproof vests. Stephanie's invention has probably saved thousands of lives. Thank you very much, Sally. So, if you thought that everything was invented by men, think again.